Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen. I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and it's Saturday, so it's grocery haul day and we have a massive grocery haul. I did a Sam's Club run and hit up my local Kroger store. So if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not, turn your bell on because we do a grocery haul every Saturday. Don't forget to check out the description box down below for nutrition coaching where I offer personalized to you macros and calories. Highly recommend this is how I've lost 140 pounds and maintain that weight loss as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching if you would like to chat with me directly and for accountability. Links, discounts to my favorite things, and of course, we'd love to have you come join our Facebook group. So let's head into the kitchen for this massive grocery haul. So the first part of my big haul is from Sam's Club. What you don't see is a case of water and a case of Gatorade Zero, but let me show you everything else that I picked up. So I bought not one, not two, but three two packs of the Members Mark Birthday Cakes Whipped Cream. This is my favorite whipped cream in the world and it is being discontinued. They only had, I would say maybe 20, two packs left. So if it's something you like as well, definitely get to Sam's Club soon because it is going away. It was a limited edition product. And then I restocked our already peeled, hard boiled eggs. This is just really convenient. They come in these little packages. Great snacks, great on the go lunch. I also bought another bag of the Just Bear chicken strips because I was completely out. These are my very favorite. I actually like the strips better than the nugget. This was new to me. This is from the brand Amy Luce. This is a nice clean ingredient brand. These are chicken burgers with American cheese, bacon, and caramelized onions. 18 grams of protein per burger, and they're a nice, fresh chicken burger. I think I'm going to store mine in the freezer, but I thought this would make a really easy, high-protein lunch or dinner. And this was new for summer, just kind of a fun limited edition Dorito. It's a collab between Tangy Pickle and Cool Ranch. I thought that that sounded really good, so I thought that I would grab those. Picked up some Lysol. Well, this is the only brand that they had the family guard which is basically Lysol so I picked a three pack up of that and then also some more disinfecting wipes I got myself some razors these were on sale for $11 for 16 razors that's a really 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 good deal and I've been obsessed with the tree hut shave oil it's my favorite thing in the whole world I'll pop a picture up here for you and I'll link it down below it is the best shaving oil in the world it leaves your legs so silky soft no bumps Nothing, I love it so much, so I got some razors for that. Cheese slices for Troy, this is his all-time favorite cheese. Palmer, can you just wait a couple minutes till we're done with the grocery haul for our friends? Okay, couple minutes. Couple minutes, Nug? You wait a couple minutes, Lola? Size potatoes because I found a smashed potato recipe that I am dying to try. So I bought some potatoes. We're gonna try that out in Wednesdays, what I eat in a day. So stay tuned. Make sure you're subscribed and your bell's on. I also bought some more pre-cooked bacon. We love this, no mess. I hate cooking bacon. I don't care if it's on the pan on the stove top, in the oven, in the air fryer. It's messy, I hate it. So I love getting pre-cooked bacon, and this is only $12, so that's an amazing price for 72 slices. I also bought some more Canadian bacon. We love this for breakfast sandwiches. Such a low calorie way to get in protein. And then I got a Caesar salad kit. I don't know, it just sounded good. I told you guys that I'm on this big salad kick lately. So I grabbed that, this was only $3. So I thought that we could have that for lunch or dinner. I picked up some more tuna fish. That's another thing I've really been liking lately. It's again, a really good way to get in protein. I needed a restock of protein shakes. That's the main reason I went to Sam's Club. So I picked up a case of Fairlife chocolate. And I picked up a case of Premier Caramel. Turkey pastrami, that is my favorite lunch meat from Sam's Club. I love it so, so, so much. It's uncured, which is what I prefer in my lunch meat. And then they finally had their True Fru back. I haven't been able to find this for a while. I love this. This is the dark chocolate coated strawberries. You can actually have an entire serving a quarter cup for 150 calories. Nice, clean ingredients. Such a great, sweet treat. I also bought some Vital Proteins collagen peptides because these were on sale and I just haven't been able to order my collagen for her. I prefer collagen for her, but this was a better deal at the moment, so I picked that up. 
And then last but not least, they finally had the Chosen Foods avocado oil spray back, so I grabbed a two pad. And here's the rest of my haul for the week from my local Kroger store. I have found some amazing deals. I'm excited to share what I picked up with you. So I went ahead and restocked Troy's cereal. I actually had a couple coupons from Kroger. So I picked up a big box of the Fiber One Honey Flakes and then two boxes of the Kashi Toasted Berry Crisp. These are his all-time favorite go-to cereals. And then I grabbed a package of hamburger buns because we wanna do Sloppy Joe's this week and I am making a chicken teriyaki burger in my meal prep. So I wanted to make sure that I had enough buns for both recipes. And then we were almost out of bread for Troy, so they didn't have much of a selection, honestly. I think the bread guy was on his way to restock, so I ended up getting the Sara Lee white bread. That'll be easy for him to have for the week. And then I needed some low carb tortillas for a recipe. I'm going to make his pasta salad, the one that I've shared here on my channel. I actually have it on my website. It's under Troy's pasta salad. It is the best pasta salad for summer. You can make it WW friendly, but it's typically not. It's a little bit higher calorie, but it's really good and he has been wanting that, so I picked up some elbow macaroni for that. Some canned goods, I needed some sliced olives for his macaroni salad, some pineapple rings for my recipe, for a dinner recipe. I needed a can of black beans for a recipe and I had a coupon for, I think 70 cents off two cans and they were only $1.25 a piece, so I went ahead and just grabbed two cans of black beans. We were almost out of sour cream and this is something you guys know we just always have in our house. I was on the hunt for the Jimmy Dean turkey sausage crumbles for my breakfast meal prep. They didn't have them. So I grabbed the sausage patties. I'm just gonna chop these up because I'm making a really good sausage based breakfast. And then I needed some diced ham for Troy's pasta salad. I grabbed some light orange juice because I have some really yummy recipes from Clean Simple Eats to share with you. I'm so excited for these. I'm going to make them both, film them both, and. I'll share them in a future video, but I needed orange juice for that. And then I saw that they had their no sugar lemonade for $2.50. It was on clearance, so I grabbed it. I've never tried it, but I've actually been really wanting lemonade, so this came at a perfect time. I need a teriyaki sauce for my meal prep, and then I've been on a big tuna fish kick for the protein, so I like sweet relish in my tuna, and I was out, so I picked up another jar. I decided to grab us some sugar cookies. These were $2.50. They we're in the clearance bakery section and Troy loves sugar cookies, so I thought that would be a nice treat this week. And then I also picked up some reduced fat sharp cheddar cheese. We just needed shredded cheese for the week. A couple gallons of 1% milk, of course, for Troy for his cereal. And I also grabbed a case of Diet Coke. And then everything else is produce. So their cherries right now with the digital coupon are only 99 cents a pound. So this whole bag was $2.50. That is an amazing, amazing, amazing deal. So I grabbed a big bag of cherries and then we've been out of mini cucumbers for a couple weeks you guys know this is a go-to for us and then i wanted some salad mix and i got this for $1.92 so i thought that was a really really good deal normally about six dollars i want to have a salad for lunch today so this will come in Perfect timing. And then their little raspberry packs are $2.79 right now. So I picked up two of those, some frozen corn for a recipe, and last but not least, a couple of Roma tomatoes. So that is my massive grocery haul from Sam's Club and Kroger. Let's jump into what's on my menu for dinners and for meal prep for the week. So here's what is on my menu for the week. So today, Saturday, is out for dinner. Troy and I are actually going to a Jeep show tonight. Tomorrow, I'm doing pesto penne pasta. Monday I'm doing teriyaki burgers with pineapple. You guys will actually see this recipe in Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day. Tuesday, Wednesday leftovers. Thursday, Sloppy Joe's. And Friday is leftovers as well. And then here's what will be in Monday's meal prep. I'm super excited for this. Breakfast is sausage egg muffins. Lunch is Southwest chicken wraps, which sounds amazing. And then for dessert, I'm making strawberry white chocolate cookies. So stay tuned for Monday's meal prep for all three recipes. Thank you for joining me for another massive, massive weekly grocery haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing everything that I picked up for the week. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not. We would love, love, love to have you here. And I do a grocery haul every Saturday. Don't forget to check out the description box for nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my favorite things, and come join our Facebook group. It's a really supportive community and we'd love to have you there as well. Thank you for watching. Happy Saturday and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Bye.